Uh, applied intelligence is a term I use to describe where we look at nature and see how nature uh, adapts you know, to the environment and then the mimic in software and hardware the, the same things. As part of the programming of these robots, inherently they, they have a tendency to communicate with each other. There is a transfer of, of knowledge. They can evolve not only mentally, their brain of what they know, but also physically. Having the ability of these robots to either reassemble themselves by latching into each other as parts. And there are many scenarios where you might need to do that. I mean, uh, one scenario is, for example, sending uh, robots to Mars, to, to another planet. In the future, I believe most devices will have some form of uh, embedded intelligence in biomedical engineering at assisted devices for people with uh, injuries. It takes a lot of time for the people to try to figure out how to, the, the artificial limb is going to work. Uh, it should be the other way around. The artificial limb should adapt to the person. I want to convey to people not to be afraid. Uh, I think that a lot of people have seen too, too many uh, Hollywood movies about Terminator, that they're going to take over. But some of these robots may be you know, uh, out there in the collecting energy and dispensing energy and providing communications to, to third world countries. So this uh, embedded intelligence in devices uh, can certainly aid uh, a lot of ailments in, in the world. So.